I'm unemployed now for six months as a tech worker. I'm sure I'm being discriminated against. After applying to 150 plus jobs, I'm now applying to Starbucks, a swimming school, and others. I'm getting rejection emails from those too. I'm running out of options. Damn. You know, it didn't have to be this way. It doesn't have to be this way. But this email, this this message I get from one of the viewers here at Over 50 TV, it's just uh, similar, very similar to, to messages, the thousands of, of messages I've received here. And what they say essentially is, I'm over 45, I'm over 50, I'm unemployed, I'm underemployed, I'm running out of options, I don't know what to do, I wish I would have done things differently, I wish I had a backup plan. Well, in this episode, what I'm going to do is I'm going to explain why having a backup plan is essential for all of us. I'm going to tell you why a backup plan can keep you in the game and possibly even insulate you from economic downturns. I'm going to go into all of that. Plus, plus I'm going to tell you, show you, give you some tips on how you can create your very own backup plan. That's all up next right here on Over 50 TV. Welcome back to Over 50 TV. My name is Lou Reyes. In a few seconds, I'm going to be telling you why you should have a backup plan if you are over 45 and working full time. Now, I know some of you out there are going to say, Lou, hey, Lou, I know why I should have a backup plan. I can't count on that job. Well, you'd be hitting the nail on the head. You'd be right. But I'm going to go into backup plans a little bit deeper. But before I jump into the episode, I do want to thank Career Fitter for sponsoring this program. Career Fitter produces a career aptitude test that I think is among the very best. And I've reviewed a lot of career aptitude tests here on Over 50 TV. But their career aptitude test can help you find a career that better fits your skills, your personality, and your interest. There's a link to the free Career Fitter career aptitude test in the description box of this video. So now, let's jump into your backup plan. If you're over 45, one of the primary reasons for having a backup plan is the risk of age discrimination. Now, despite laws against such practices, it's well documented that older workers often encounter biases that can affect their job stability and, and actually also affect their health. You know, a study by the AARP found that nearly two out of three workers age 45 and older have seen or experienced age discrimination at work. And this bias, it can lead to fewer opportunities for advancement, being passed over for promotions, or even layoffs. Another factor to consider is the evolving nature of industries and job roles. And when I say this, I'm also thinking about AI and how it is changing the workplace and actually it's changing the world. But there are other technological advancements and that includes automation that are that are reshaping the workforce. And they're rendering some skills, this automation, this new technology is rendering some skills obsolete while while admittingly increasing the demand for new ones. And for workers who are over 45, staying competitive, being able to get one of those new jobs in the new workforce, it's going to require continuous learning and adaptation, which I know and I admit and I see and I hear from viewers all the time how it can be daunting. But what choice do we have? Furthermore, economic downturns, market volatility, well, they add another layer of uncertainty. In COVID-19, the pandemic, for instance, it led to significant job losses and highlighted the vulnerability of even seasoned professionals. So a backup plan, yes, it can provide a safety net during those unforeseen disruptions. So what constitutes a robust backup plan? Well, first, Upgrading skills through continuous education and training is crucial. Online courses, certifications, and professional development programs can help older workers stay relevant and competitive. Secondly, diversifying income streams can mitigate your risk. Exploring freelance work, consulting, or even starting a small business can provide additional financial stability. 
Additionally, having a solid financial plan is imperative. Now, this includes saving for emergencies, investing wisely, and planning for retirement. Financial advisors can offer valuable guidance tailored to individual needs and goals. Lastly, networking and maintaining professional relationships can open doors to new opportunities. You know, when it comes to networking, I've always said, if you can talk and if you can walk right in that door, you'll meet someone who could potentially offer you an opportunity that you wouldn't get if you weren't networking. But also, I'm going to suggest that you be active in industry associations, attend conferences, and use platforms like LinkedIn. They can help older professionals like you and me stay connected and informed about market trends. Let me conclude by saying, I know, I know the job market presents a significant challenge for people who are over 45. I know because I get a lot of messages from folks who are in their 40s, 50s, 60s, or older who tell me how tough it is out there for them. I also know from firsthand experience, but I also know having a well-thought-out plan, a backup plan, can make a substantial difference. It's all about being proactive, staying informed, and being ready to navigate the uncertainties of the evolving workplace. Preparing now. Preparing today ensures that you remain resilient, adaptable, and secure in your career and secure in your financial future. Well, there you go, my friends. I've just told you about the importance of having a backup plan. I don't think I can say any any more. I just know from the thousands of comments I get from viewers, I know there are many of them out there who wish they would have created a backup plan. And I know that many of them know that had they done that, they'd be in a better position today. So that's all I got for you. If you have any questions, any comments, go ahead and make uh, make a comment in the comment box. Also, don't forget, I do have the free Career Fitter Career Aptitude Test. The link is in the description box. You can check that out as well if you're somebody who's looking to, to find a career that better fits your skills, your personality, and your interests. Well, as I said, that's all I have for you. And as I always say, have a great day, everybody. 